Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Guitar of the Day. I'm your host, Michael Lemo, and today we have a very special treat. It's Mr. Jonathan Stout. Hey everybody. Yes, yes. How you been, Jonathan? I'm great. I'm super excited to be here, and you know, I'm just such a huge internet fan of Lemo. So oh, is, <laughs> no! The guitars are great, but you know, you get to, you get to hang out with Michael there. Well, you're an amazing treat for the shop to, ha to have play. Seriously, it's so cool. I, I always try to cover these arch tops, and I just don't do a great job. <laughs> so we had to call you, and uh, I know you do that that swing thing so great. So let's see what we got. Yeah, we got a super fun guitar of the day. This is a oh, an wow. approximately 1928 Gibson L4. Mm -hmm. wow. Eddie Lang would have played something like this before he got the L5, but this is not an ordinary L4. This has a one-of-a-kind custom mandolin style peg head. Oh, um, and it's got these banjo tuners on the back. Um, but yeah, this is one of those weird Gibson unicorn guitars um, that are just different. It's a special, somebody special ordered it, and uh, you're you're not going to find this many places outside of Norman's Rare Guitars. No, nope, I agree. So what, what age did you start getting into that kind of music? Was it always just there with you? You know, in high school, I started swing dancing. And, oh, uh, no. I mean, believe it or not, I don't want to, I don't want to speak ill of playing rock music. No, as no, far as, as I love far as it all, man. Well, I'll just say this, playing thrash metal as a teenager did not make me make the ladies interested in me and uh, as a teenage boy I find boy, the same issue <laughs> <laughs> that's what I was going for and I started swing dancing and uh, I just got into this music and then got into playing it and I, I did meet my my wife through this so wow, like, wow. it worked it worked yeah See? no no <laughs> and you know what too there's something about chords and being able to hear every note in the chord when you're shredding I love shredding and I love you know Eddie Van Halen to the end of the day for me but but there's something about having that clean channel so you can hear those seventh chords, all those different inversions. And, and I I mean, I remember hearing uh, Hendrix doing you know, like Little Wing mm -hmm. or like his version of um, uh, Like a Rolling Stone from Monterey Pop. And there's that kind of Isley Brothers chord melody yeah, thing that he's yeah. doing. I always wanted to learn to do that. And I never quite got there. And then when I started doing this stuff, it was like, oh, this is kind of like a similar thing. Oh, yeah. So, you know, but it's all about getting the melody and the harmony together. And like, it doesn't matter what kind of music it is. When you put those two together, that's when you get the magic. Well, that's such a great thing. And with this guitar, you, you, it's a match made in heaven. So, Ooh, yeah, let's check yeah, out let's the back. Let's take a look at the back. Yes. Wow. Yeah, it's in great shape. Yeah, I mean, this is, is a 19, from the 1920s. Um, you know, it's an old, old, old guitar. Wow. It's <laughs> even got the stinger. The yeah. Top. Really, really, really cool. But that headstock is a, a yeah, piece Yeah, that's, that's the winner. You know, you just you know, get a friend with an F5 mandolin and you can have a band together and have yeah. matching headstocks. Yeah, yeah and also maybe some security. <laughs> <laughs> but really cool guitar. We really appreciate you doing this. And uh, such a treat. We hope to have you back. And uh, Anytime. Do you yeah. want to hear it? Well, should we go well, up there? Let's take and... it out front. All right, let's go. Finally, let's go. I get to sit and watch. <laughs> let's do it. <laughs> All right, now we're back here with the... Uh, L4 with the custom mandolin peg head, and uh, it's got banjo tuners on the back. And uh, this is another one of those one of a kind Gibson things. A friend of mine has an expression that 10% uh, of Gibsons are just different from back in that era, that there's just all these one offs and you know, using up parts, or somebody came in hungover on Monday morning. Um, and this is just another one of those, you know, Gibson unicorns. I've never seen anyone, another one like it. So, uh, but let's hear this awesome L4. Heaven, I'm in heaven, and my heart beats so that I can hardly speak, and I seem to find the happiness I seek. When we're out together dancing cheek to cheek Heaven I'm in heaven And the cares that hung around me through the week Seem to vanish like the gambler's lucky streak when we're out together, dancing cheek to cheek Oh, I'd love to climb a mountain And to reach the highest peak But it doesn't thrill me half as much as dancing cheek to cheek And I'd love to go out fishing In a river or a creek 
But it doesn't thrill me half as much as dancing cheek to cheek. Dance with me. I want my arm about you. That charm about you will carry me through to heaven. I am in heaven. And my heart beats so that I can hardly speak. And I seem to find the happiness I see When we're out together dancing cheek to cheek When we're out together dancing cheek to cheek When we're out together dancing cheek to cheek Uh, Gibson L4 here at Norm's Rare Guitars. You can check me out at Jonathan Stout uh, anywhere on the internet, but uh, at Campus5 on Instagram or at Bandcamp for all of my CDs. And uh, you can find this little guy at Norm's Rare Guitars. That was great. Amazing. Cool.